Many people when they see this giant insect, they think, oh, locust, it could be a locust bug. Now he's nibbling on me right now. In fact, it is actually a grasshopper. And you really shouldn't touch them because they do, if they're irritated, they will excrete a foamy toxin. And the bright color is aposematism to warn predators of its toxicity. In fact, this is the Eastern Lober grasshopper. It is a pretty advantageous grasshopper. It'll feast on just about any kind of herbaceous material or green leaves. Now this is a full grown one. I wouldn't need it. Definitely. There. And uh, they feast on many different garden plants and vegetables. And uh, this one's pretty docile. They're slow moving. Let them crawl into my hand so I can get them off my shoulder and keep them in view here. Now, usually varying in red to yellow. Mosquitoes are serious out here. So I never recommend holding one. Now this is a pretty large one. I'm gonna let it back go on some herbaceous material. And uh, it is not a locust. So if you see one of these, it is not the great locust plague from the Bible. It is actually just a lober grasshopper. As I release this lober grasshopper, it began eating the leaves on this hackberry tree. How can a tiny grasshopper grow so big in one year and undergo a complete transformation of color? You thought this was a video all about an insect. It's more about the things you may see every day. The things that don't get noticed, even though they're right in your face. Everything seems the same till one day, everything's just totally different. Things will always be different. That's a fact we can't change. Sometimes you pay good enough attention, you can witness the change. If you pay good enough attention, you can improve the way things change. Well, I guess if you pay enough attention and focus on something, you really can do anything you dream. For me, building a YouTube channel parallels planting a bamboo seed. I started this channel way back in 2017. So instead of the bamboo seed, I'll just show my average views of my channel so you can see what I mean. You start with the little bamboo seed, plant it and water it for a whole year, but nothing happens. The second year you water it again, nothing happens. The third year you water it and still no sign of your effort. How frustrating. If you stayed consistent and continue to water it into the fifth year, the tree finally sprouts and grows up to 90 feet in six weeks. I'm happy to have every one of you watching my videos and please show a little bit of love by tapping that like button. That really helps a lot. And from the bottom of my heart, I'll thank you for that. Post a comment and I'll respond to you.